hello hi and welcome to my channel today i am going to be showing you guys how i made these super cute little deer and cow keychains and i'm so obsessed with them i don't know I mean, the tiktok strawberry cow maybe i'll put it in if it's not copywritten i don't know it's tiktok music um but anyway i made a little strawberry cow and a little strawberry deer and i'm gonna show you how i did it uh so yeah if you're interested keep on watching Okay, so tonight I'm gonna make a strawberry cow and I'm super excited about this. I already made one and it kind of worked, but I need to try it again with just normal resin because I used UV resin for the whole thing and I didn't like it. It shriveled and looked weird. So I'm gonna be using Paint Heifer's Porno Pink. Got a bit of Mary Jane. Got White Dragon. And then we got Fruit Punch. And I'm gonna show you guys how to make a cute little strawberry cow keychain. So here was my first attempt with UV resin and as you can see it's not good. It like shriveled and just I don't know I tried to put a top coat over the top with more UV resin and I just don't like it at all. So we're gonna try and make one better today with just normal resin. So here is the UV resin I'm gonna be using. I got this off of Amazon and then I also have a UV light that we're gonna be using as well. So I'm gonna use this literally just for the smaller parts on this because that did work okay. Okay so what I'm gonna do first is the tiny little strawberries. So this is UV resin and you don't want to work around any light or anything because it will cure. So you want to make sure you give it a shake so this is shaken up and I'm just going to put a little bit down here just on a piece of cardboard. So once you have a little bit of resin, I'm going to take the color for my stems, which is going to be this green Mary Jane. I'm just going to scoop a bit, not too much, plop that down there and we're going to mix that together. I do want this to be pretty thick. So now what I'm gonna do is put in my little strawberry tops. I'm just gonna do a little stem. And I'm kind of working backwards. So the stems I want first, so that you'll see the leaves like in front of the strawberries. We're just making like little chicken feet. Okay, and I think that's enough strawberries. I'm just going to take my UV light, slide it underneath, and then cure it for about 60 seconds. And now to do the pink for the strawberries. Um, make as heart shaped or triangle shaped as I can. And look real plumpy. Little strawberries. Scraped up as much of this as I can. 
can if we put it in the horns. Okay, so now we're going to put this in the light. So making a little beer. Okay, and I'm just going to check, make sure these are set. So now we're going to mix up the background color and that I'm going to use actual resin for. So now what we're going to do is taking white dragon and a bit of fruit punch, I'm going to make a very light white color. Not light white, I meant light pink. Dump in just a tiny bit of pink. I don't want too much because I don't want it to be too pink. But we're just going to start with this. See how that makes like a super pretty light pink color? I think that's perfect actually. I don't think I want to go any darker than that because this one was a little too dark and you kind of lost the difference between the strawberries and the pink. I think this is really good. Okay, we're just going to dump that in here and this is the normal resin now. This isn't the UV resin so this is going to have to set overnight. I like my molds to be as full as possible. Now we're just going to hit it with the heat gun. And we're going to leave it set overnight. Okay, and here is our strawberry cow and strawberry deer. So we're going to open up the cow first. <laughs> I don't know why this happened. Super cute, this one's a lot better. But I don't know why this happens. I can totally touch it up though, could have messed up the horn. See the deer. This one's really cute too. Oh, I love these. 
These turned out so much better than the first ones. These are super cute. So yeah, that was um, a quick video on these cute little keychains, the little cow and the little deer. The cow is for me and I'm giving the deer to my best friend Del and I already showed her of it and she loves it. Um, but yeah, anyway, so the little strawberry pieces, um, I did use the UV resin and then the full pink parts on both of them, I used just the normal um, art resin. Uh, just because I had that weird issue in the past where the UV resin shriveled up, I don't know... I don't know what I did wrong there. I still need to mess around with UV resin, but I did end up putting a top coat over this with UV resin. So both of them have a top coat just because how you saw like the little divots were left. Um, so I did top coat them in UV resin, let that cure. And then yeah, these are the finished pieces. I uh, hope you enjoyed, you know, another keychain tutorial. Uh, I'm making a ton of keychains again, but a little bit different this time. Um, I've got some, you know, I made these, hold on. So I made these, I don't know if you can see them, but they are freaking gorgeous. It'll focus on them rather than my face. <laughs> there we go. And like this M, look at that. But anyway. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any ideas for more um, designs with these little animals, let me know. Because I just thought Strawberry Cow, like the song on TikTok, I don't know. I don't know. I just thought it was cute. Um, But yeah, I hope you liked this video. And I'll see y'all in the next one. It's probably going to be a minute because I'm going back stateside. But anyway, here you go. See you one last look. Bye.